Hey guys, welcome to another amazing episode of Fishing with Alias. We're right here at the Miami Boat Show with Andrew Hill. At Adventure Fishing yeah. in New Zealand. I'm gonna link his page down below. He, he gets a lot of fish, that's what he says. So you guys go there and check it out. He's the one that designed this awesome looking fishing watercraft. So let's get to it. This is our rear boarding ladder. This is actually attached to the extended deck. The Fish Pro has an extra 30 centimeters on it allowing for the second set of link system okay and if you take all this off here you've got a great swim platform or you can move your cooler box from the front link to the rear link okay and then you'd actually increase your casting area so all this area here you could use for casting you've also got your angled foot wedges here typically when i'm fishing out there i might fish side on so i'll have my backside on here both feet on here and be able to fish off the side so what I'm going to show you here is that we've got the easy access storage here. The beauty of the ST3 hull on the Fish Pro is that all your storage is now in front of the handlebars so you can access it from sitting on the seat here, really convenient. Comes with this storage organizer here so you can put your sort your tackle and bits and pieces and add them in here and also the fuel is filled from here now. Also with the Fish Pro we've got trolling mode which is actually activated through this button here. Once you access this, you can scroll up and down through these arrows to slow down or increase your speed to catch the fish that you're trying to... The maximum speed of the fish pro, 55 miles per hour. So you've got your bench seat here, especially designed for fishing. This particular fish pro here is the audio option. So this has a 70 litre fuel cell and you could typically on a nice day you get up to 100 miles range on it. The base model US is 14799. It includes the cooler and the Garmin sounder on there with an inhale transducer. It's an extra 800 for the audio system. Alright so you could stand up here, get on the boat. It comes with the cooler right here, has a ruler. These rod holders, you can move them from place to place. You put them here, or you can put them there. It has a big standing platform. You can remove the cooler, and you have more fishing area. The seating is for three people. One, two, three. But two will fish comfortably. Look at that storage right there. It's crazy. It has a lot of storage. The base model is like $15,000 and includes a sounder. But if you want to add extra, like the speaker and things like that, that will be extra money. Wow. Look at that storage. Ooh. You could definitely throw fish in there and all this stuff. Mm hmm. Ooh. It has mirrors in there, the sounder, the trawler. Wow. It doesn't come with its own trailer, you have to order that separately. Wow, this thing looks sweet. Nice, see do. This thing never flicks over. It's very stable. You can stand up and fish, no problem. And if water gets here, since you turn that motor on, this thing is gonna lift, and all that water is gonna come out of there, no problem. Boat of max power, fish pro. This is some of the specifications here: starting price, different models, what's included. The trailer is optional; it's extra. Several accessories that you could add to it. The cooler. 600 pounds, you could take three people. It is 147 inches long, 49.4 inches wide, and it's 44.9 inches tall. Okay guys, they are saying that this boat is unthinkable. I heard somebody said that. That is pretty hard to think. I, I really wanna try it and try to flip it on the water, see what happens. This is crazy. Uh, they had it on pretty big rough weather and really high winds and still performed really good. You could go up to like, what, 60 miles an hour on this thing? I'm not really sure, but this thing looks sweet. Looks sweet, awesome design, a lot of accessories like 
things that you wish you had on a kayak, but it's it costs you. You're talking about boat money right here, but I think it's worth it. It's like the <laughs> one man fishing machine, or actually two, because you could put more than two people in here, more than one people in here. Just rate it for three. Pretty awesome stuff. Audio and everything, speakers, mirrors, fish finders, storage, a lot of stuff. Thank you for watching.